Hey guys, Zoe here with Wahala Toys. Today we're going to do an unboxing of the John Wick Deluxe Action Figure Kit from, uh, it... Diamond Select. Yes. It's from Diamond Select. Sorry, I have a, a lot of dates and a lot of action figures riding around up in my head. So, before we get started, you know, come on over and check us out over at ValhallaToyShop.com. Uh, check out our new pre-orders and what we have in stock. Uh, we have a sale going on today that ends tonight at 11.59 Central Standard Time. Uh, it is code four, April 420? April 420. April yep. 420. And uh, we have another sale going on that also ends tonight. It's buy two, get one free of any of our $5 pops in the $5 pop section. And that is uh, BOGO FUNKO is the code. We will put the, you know, description or uh, the coupon code up here on the screen and oh. then it'll also be in the description all the links all the codes all the everything. everything's all the social medias everything all over the place everywhere all right so of course i have my badass chicks here to help me out with this but before we get started again uh if you want to head on over to raise energy drink and use the code bahali toy shop you can get 15 percent off any of your purchases to kick your your toy hunt into hyperdrive so, without further ado, let's get started. Here he is. There's that. We'll give you a second to look at that, and then we'll get started on our opening. So. here at the bottom and we've never actually seen this before so i'm we're, pretty excited we're opening this we together we should note that the first shipments of these were literally lost at sea so chapter four john wick the drowning occurred all right so i'm going to jump in really quick right so i said the first order was lost at sea literally there's a bunch of john wicks in the bottom of the ocean so we arrived yesterday and last night we had tornadoes come through the area and hailstorms in some areas, including our neighborhood, the size of baseballs. So there's something about John Wick, apparently, that is putting a curse on us. But anyways, the pre-orders went out yesterday, or excuse me, went out today, and the rest will follow. So back to the video. So these arrived months late. So you're getting an upshot, upside down shot view right now. So, so we'll flip them around. Oh, Baba Yaga himself. All right, look at that. You even got your own, your own marker. All right, let's... Little known fact, this is how I convinced Zoe to marry me, was with a blood marker. So, it's a nifty trick. There's a whole lot of case for this guy. That there is. we go, that gives her a lot of the glare. Right. Here, let me zoom in a little bit. Oh, no, All no. right. There we go. All right. So what I do like that I see already is not only is obviously one of the pistols. I'm going to go with a Glock, I'm guessing. I don't know, but. And also a roll of gold coins actually come out of the chest. I don't know if the uh, K-bar and everything else does. We can talk about that later. Get your own little like diorama. All right, so that's kind of cool. I didn't even know that was going to be a thing. A bunch of uh, death and destruction. Looks like from the uh, car chase scene. Oh no, he's stuck in. 
I have a feeling he's going to be tied in and rubber banded in and all that kind of good stuff. I like that they put the tie as if he's in motion. I mean... I mean, when I, is Baba Yaga not in motion? Oh, that's a good point, but you just tried to kill him. I'm sorry. You're over here murdering John Wick. Oh, I'm sorry. He'll come well, back. Well, you'll pay for that. He'll come back for me. So, you want to pull his little stand out there? Yeah. I'll hold him up a little bit for you. So, I do kind of like it, even though... It, well, I guess even if he's not in motion, you get the effect like the wind is blowing. So, that's kind of cool. Right. And now, for the ultimate test of how easy does he stand up on his... All right, let's see how he fits on his display stand. Is he nice and snug and he's going to yes. stay put? He is indeed. All right. All right, let's bust out the rest of the accessories. Ooh, I think I see a surprise in this marker. It looks as though you can open it. It does look that way. It definitely looks like there's a little hinge on there. It's got really great detail. It does. Let's see. Can you get this open? While she is messing with that, let's look at this face sculpt. I mean, if that's not Keanu, I don't know what is. I mean, they even got the detail on the beard down pretty solid. So, I'm digging that. And just in case any girls are uh, watching... Oh, sorry. They covered his booty. No Keanu booty for the ladies out there today. Alright, see that bigger gold coin. Looks good. Solid detail again. Alright, so unfortunately our marker does not open. Mm. It is only for show. Well, that's, uh, uh, that's the first disappointment I've had yet. Of gold. All right, so those do not come out. Okay. It looks good though. The detail looks good. I'm digging it. It does. It looks like our what are these smoke grenades? But it fits. Yep. Oh. Decent. Fits very oh, nicely in there. Awesome. So let's get our so the measurements are good. They definitely did not cheap out on this. So there's a roll of gold coins. Let's see, probably what his Glock. I'm gonna go with Glock. I think he used Glocks most of the time in the movies, but I'm gonna say that somebody's gonna be like, "No, it was a Sig," and I'm gonna be like, "I don't know. He used a million guns." So. I don't really pay that close of attention. Alright, let's get out some of his other fun guns. And to Mayor Potts out there, who uh, talks trash about my John Wick movies, you know why you're banned from the dojo. So if you're watching, just know Bobby Yeager doesn't forget. And more importantly, doesn't forgive. Alright, now this is pretty solid. We got ourselves a little weapons crate. So, I guess for a size reference, I'm a decently sized human. But, I mean, this has some excellent detail on it. It does. The hinges on that wow. are solid. That is actually really cool. And more importantly, it actually works with pretty, pretty good motion. And stuff goes boom. I'm sure all that plastic has been annoying the shit out of you guys because it's annoying the shit out of me. But unfortunately, we don't do the packaging. All right. So definitely got some shotgun action. 
what I assume is going to be, you know, somewhat of a an AR-10, AR-15, somewhere around those lines. It's pretty cool. I think this has a little EOTech sight on it, if I'm not mistaken. And it does. I don't know if I'm going to get that to focus. But that is definitely an EOTech on the rail system. So that is pretty cool. And I just totally turned it sideways. But, best part, it all fits together. And comes together nicely. Now that is pretty cool. All right, so let's see. let's see if we can get a little setup of everything. John Wick, Bobby Yeager himself, gun in hand, ready for vengeance and all that good stuff. I cannot wait for the next John Wick, Wick films. Uh, definitely my favorite Keanu Reeves character. So, yeah, actually, you know what? We should let's check the articulation. Let's see what we're right, looking at so here. The articulation is. A little rough, but it holds steady. Alright. And, of course, articulation. It looks like at the knees, of course. So, let's take him off the stand and see what his legs are capable of. Alright. So, so, he has good ankle articulation. Oh, that's cool. Alright. goes... Pretty good, and you can even go oh. sideways as if he broke his ankle. All right. But let's be honest, it's John Wick. What does he ever break? Everything. That he does. Everything in his body. So. All right. Him without. Without a stand. I mean, he's pretty stable. Pretty stable, yeah. So. It does not look like you'll be able to do a running one, but. But then again, more uh, people out there are way more creative than. That they are. We are. So. Let's see. You want to stick a AR in his ha other hand? See if we can get that. Yeah, going. let's see how easily these uh, other weapons fit in. All right. So let's see. I'll oh, no, just choose know. one. Go tactical shotgun. Go, shotgun. you know, whatever you want. Yeah. Let's see. All right. It would be super great is if the grip allowed him to actually. I wonder if he can actually hold. With both hands, if it'll work out. <clears throat> I don't think it will, because he doesn't. It, his articulation doesn't let him bend like inwards too well. Can we get him at least somewhere in this neighborhood? Is what I was looking for. Does do his wrists articulate at all? His twisty wrist, or anything? His wrists are not articulated. They don't turn. Okay. So that to me is kind of a a skimp out a little bit. I would have liked to see the the wrists roll, the hands roll side to side. Yeah. A bit. We can do kind of that and see if we can sort of. You can sort of get him there. Sort of. So. Not too well, you know, but... I mean, all in all, I'm happy. I, I think I'm happiest, though, with the face sculpt. I think that's what I like best in terms of the figure itself. But, I mean, this chest with everything, you know, pieces that come out, things that fit in easily. Uh, he goes on the stand easily and stays there. So, all in all, I'm going to say it's a good figure. Uh, it is $44.99 on ValhallaToyShop.com but don't forget we do have a 20% off $50 or more so pick up him one other item and get a nifty discount so there he is you know all in all uh, at the price point because of the accessories I think he's worth the money uh, this one we usually don't open toys we're inbox collectors but this one I wanted for me so we decided to share it with you guys, and we hope you enjoyed it. Uh, anything from you, babe? No, just come check out ValhallaToyShop.com. All right. Help us help you. Well, y'all are going to notice some uh, little jumpiness because my fat fingers kept hitting the stop button. So excuse that in advance. And uh, yeah, visit ValhallaToyShop.com. Check us out. Instagram, Facebook. We don't use the Twitters anymore. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And I guess we're going to start doing more YouTubes. We are, we are definitely going to start doing more YouTubes. So, right. you know, come check us out. 
come check us out and, you know, make your collection worthy of the gods. Later.